Hey, what's up, my crowns and tiaras? Welcome to Etoxic Tea Lounge. Everything in this video was allegedly. Let's talk. Disclaimer I do not condone in any form of bullying or violence on this platform. Anything in this video is for information purposes and entertainment purposes only. These are my opinions and just that. So today, the only thing we're going to be discussing in this video is Sierra and her sister. Yes, the family is fighting. Okay, Sierra's sister decided to expose a lot of things, call her addicted to perks and nasty and doing this and doing that. And we're going to get into all of the receipts. So please make sure to like, comment subscribe and share this video y'all gotta run this video up okay everything in this video is whatever that's posted online okay that's what i do and i give y'all my opinions so sierra and her sister okay clearly they don't have a close relationship a lot of family members don't it's not nothing unusual for family members to fight or you know you know disown each other or whatever the case may be right so this is what she says. Nobody can't clock my T. Never hit my weight journey. I used to be big as F. What about now? Okay. This she's showing y'all a picture of her now saying clock the body now. Please don't cap like you was just giving me free money, baby. That was to get you perks every day. Now y'all can pause to read it right here. I'm not going to post your number or nothing, but can you please tell me how much I spent on perks for Sierra? About $1,200 a week, $1,200 for sure, sometimes $1,500. So allegedly, this person is basically asking, you know, she's asking this person about, you know, the receipts. I got you 20 perks the day you left the hospital and you took all 20 in two days on my son. Okay, y'all can pause to read this. I just picked Sierra up the one to some. She got out the hospital now. That's good, but soon the pharmacy will call me. I'll see if y'all still want them. She said, when you go into the pharmacy, already been waiting on them to tell me they ready. She said, can she be the first you tell? Oh, wow, that really gives addict. Um, Check the dates, boo. That same 200 you just post acting like you gave it to me because I needed it was for your perks. This is all the money I go spend on you for your perks. 350, 220, 170, and 200. She says, girl, I asked you to help me pay my rent one time after I lost everything and you didn't do it. You can never sit and call me broke. My God pay every bill I got. Get me every bag, shoe, clothes I want. I'm good. And I go out and make my own money every day. She says, that's $40 you sent was to get your son some food because you left him in the house by himself for four days chasing eggplant. Please, let's not cap. Oh, my God. Why are you deleting messages, Sierra? Show them why you were sending me money. Oh, my God. Y'all clearly see me saying I'm in front of the perk man. Send the money. What the F? So she's actually showing receipts and text messages. Um... Your daughter was just staying um, on my sofa, hated to go home because she's neglected there, but I'm broke. Be Apple paying her $10 for blunts so she could smoke. Man, but I'm broke. Okay. Can you to the door garage? All right. So that is the daughter right there. The text messages um, talking to her aunt. Okay, basically saying, you know, come open the garage door. Basically just showing that she was over there trying to get in. Let me know how y'all feel about that. Um, asking me to edit your big back butt body, but I'm fat, girl. I'll go live and show my whole, I'll go live and show my whole body right now. Um, this is Miss Rich saying she can't keep paying money on real designer. She needs the fake. So y'all can pause to read those messages. Um, this is you talking about your daughter Paris being so nasty, how you be picking up shitty drawers and you were so tired of it. You was going to get her an apartment only wanting to pay 1100 um, for her rent. Um, my boyfriend pay every bill and give me whatever I want. And before I met him, I was doing it. So broke where? Um, now I got rich guy. Unlike you, you got to pay for love. Literally take care of grown men. Okay, y'all can pause to read those text messages. 
This is not about money. Sierra take care of her guys. Her guy right now is driving her cars every day. Moved out his condo to stay with her rent free. She the type to get 30k out the bank and give it to him and record him giving it to her like he doing for her. Sick. They sit and get high taking 15 to 20 perks a day stalking his ex. It's the principle. She will get on here and act like she live a totally different life. Okay, um, lied saying she gave my mom 20k for a car. I'm finna post them receipts. We not feeling entitled to her money because we got our own, but I don't like you doing the stuff you not. Okay, so right here, okay, let's talk about the 20k. You gave my mama. My mama spent her own 20k and you said you was gonna give her 10 back and never get. Like, stop the cap, Sierra. I have receipts for everything. You clearly see my mom asking, did her guy who sold her the car get the money she sent? So y'all can make sure y'all pause to read that because now the mama's in the mix, okay? So let me know how y'all feel about that. Then she says, I asked my guy to buy my baby some wipes yesterday. He sent $500. This is what he do daily though. I promise you I'm straight. Him and your guy can go rack for rack, and he will embarrass him, okay? Right there, she's showing about the thank you, daddy, whatever, whatever. Now, she puts this up and says, Sierra, this is you before you sat and got your face worked on eight times. Clock that. This is her sister, mind you. This is this is what's going on, Okay. Now, she also put this out, letting that guy go freak off on you, bringing you back STDs, and this was a rare every month thing. Ew. Man, I can on go on and on. Why would you ever play with me? Can you find me some medicine, please, dearie? Perks? No. <laughs> My coochie still hurt. It's still burning or just sore? Or... <laughs> <laughs> we can't show the video, but right here, look at him driving your car like it's his, fingering you freaked out, but putting all that discharge in his mouth. <laughs> then she says, you say I'm texting off a text ad, baby. This is your number. Oh my God, Sierra, stop lying. I'm gonna just keep showing receipts. I'm a be I believe her. There's no way she got all the time last minute to just put out all these fake receipts. Um... Oh, okay, I don't have to lie about nothing. You started with me thinking it was funny trying to bully and body shame me. Now I'm exposing the real you. Play victim, girl. Boo. Rarefy information. That's her number. I looked it up. Blah, blah, blah. I just found my other phone with everything in it. Oh, let's play. This you asking me to get you 15 perks just for that day. And I believe her. These text messages don't look no fake, okay? And this is from her other phone. She's just showing you the proof. I clearly stated I will pay for everything. I just needed help planning, girl. Who broke and needed you? Laughing my butt off, but you want to body shame me. Y'all can pause to read that, okay? Now, right here, she's basically saying, but you want to call me a catfish, girl, huh? You bigger than me when I was big, okay? Because y'all know Sierra got surgeries, um, laughing my butt off. I don't edit my body at all. I jump straight on live with the same body. I work hard for this body. Boo, edit for what? And no shame to BBWs because I used to be one and I showed that to the world. I'm secure with myself. And this is my way after the baby. Clock it, big mama. But I'm done exposing the truth. Would I have never did it if she didn't call my baby, her nephew, ugly, and had her daughter expose me. So I simply gave them what they asked for. You my big sister and show me no loyalty I, and tried to bully and body shame me. And I ate your butt up. But pop you a perk and enjoy your day, mamas. Think twice before playing with me. I'm going. Okay. And like I said, the receipts that she put out, like, don't get me wrong, it's a lot of people out here that make fake receipts and stuff, so it's really hard nowadays to, you know, really believe receipts nowadays, because AI and all type of apps and edits and everything that you can do. But me personally, um, I believe her, okay? I believe her, um, I believe the receipts, um, and it just is what it is. Do you understand what I'm saying? Okay. Um, another thing. We're going to get into what Sierra said um, in her video. We're going to hear what she got to say. She's basically saying it's cap and it's just a, a text app that she's using. Okay. But she was like literally posting receipt after receipt after receipt really fast. So 
I don't think that she had the time and energy at that moment, okay? Because it just happened. You know, Sierra said whatever she said. They had a little bickering or whatever. And she just started posting receipts, okay? So, what? Did she plan all of this already? Did she already have everything in her phone ready to expose the fake receipts? Nah, I, I just don't buy it. But let's get into what Sierra had to say. If you know Sierra from reality TV and everything else, she is a liar. She lies and she exaggerates things and she always plays victim. This is just how she be moving. So at this point, I believe that she's on perks. I believe everything. But listen to what she had to say. Yeah, them texts. And then I was showing on a thing like she got to have some type of text app that she was changing the text messages. Time I sent her money, um, 2700 twelve hundred dollars in the week for some purpose like this like y'all have to know that this girl is a compulsive liar she's known for being a compulsive liar of the family girl she'll be like this let me tell y'all what kind of line this girl do she'll be like at my house when i first got my penthouse she was making posts she'll take all my chanel bags my louis vuitton bags at my penthouse my nigga just bust down for me he just took me shopping. Y'all gotta know her to know. My sister's a compulsive liar. God, please. We all scared of her. My old friends, all of us, we all scared of her. We be like, uh-uh, because we know she crazy. And baby, when she get mad, she gonna goddamn go to social media and make up some more shit. We all scared of her. Baby, she put together receipts. And I posted mine earlier, too. Then she talk about I put my boyfriend chain. Y'all, it just honestly, y'all. She said what she said. Y'all believe it if y'all want to, cause I was earlier posting stuff and I had to catch myself. I said, Sierra, you're a millionaire today. You're gonna be a millionaire tomorrow, and this girl gonna be somewhere sitting around still doing the same shit. Like, okay, the only thing I get from her video is that she's just basically saying that her sister made up the receipts. She's not. Uh, she's not denying being addicted to perks. She's not denying anything that was really being said. She's just talking about the damn receipts. And I think she's only doing that to cover it up, to make it seem as if it was fake receipts because she's embarrassed of what her sister put out there. She's probably kind of shocked that her sister put out her business out there. Now, I see the text messages and it is what it is. I feel like it's the truth. Um, I just feel like, uh, Sierra's trying to save face. Now, don't, now, don't get me wrong. It's a messed up situation that both of these grown ass ladies that are sisters are doing this online to embarrass each other. Okay. I feel like that is a personal matter that they should take up with each other. But at the end of the day, we can't, we can't stop nobody from exposing whoever they want to expose on the internet. It's the internet. So at this point, it is what it is. Hopefully they get it together. Um, situations like that, I feel like there's no coming back. If you want to put out my business, you want to try to embarrass me online, you want to try to get me in trouble with anything by, you know, using the things that you know against me, you're dead to me. You're done to me. There's no conversation. There's no nothing. It is what it is. That's just basically how it is. Okay. Um, but everybody's different. They might go back sisterly loving and stuff like that. Me personally, I don't care if you're a sister, a brother, a cousin, an aunt, a mother, a father. I don't care who you are. Okay. If you disrespect me, you expose things about me or trying to hurt me in any type of way or my kids and you bring my kids up in it, you're done to me. Okay. There's no, no, no nothing over here. I'm not feeling sorry for nothing. Because if you did that to me, just, just understand that you're going to be done with me for good. Okay. But we shall see how that's going to transpire. I know a lot, a lot of people, us, we either disown our family, um, or you have the types that go back and forth with their family online or in person fighting them and stuff like that. I don't do none of that. But there's a lot of people out here that do do that. Okay. But like I said, that's their family matter, okay? They put it on the internet and we're talking about it. It is what it is. But let me know down in the comments below. Do you think that her sister, Derry, is basically lying and just making up all these receipts and stuff like that to make her sister a way that she's really not? Or do you think that there is some truth with the receipts? Let me know down in the comments below. Anyway, like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Run it up, okay? And also, if you have anything that y'all want me to talk about, hit on my Instagram. It's the same name as my YouTube, okay? 
Anyway, adios, toodaloos, bye bye. Ooh, shawty, you tried me. Voice getting filled with entitlement. Why would you tell me those?